in I was in a original slash cover band back in the day, and uh, that band was called Headwall, and we did originals. I went to the city, got paid nothing. You know, usually right. I had to pay to park and buy my bar bill and everything else. You got paid twenty bucks, maybe divide that by four people. And that didn't pay anything. So, but then Kinda we did. Sounds like a poison crew gig. But go on. <laughs> so, that was back maybe in the day. But anyways, so um, something happened with the guitarist, and um, um, my wife and I were having a baby. Not me, but my wife. And everybody thought Headwall was being uh, disassembled uh, because of that. And it wasn't that reason. I love singing and music and everything. So um, some people said, you know, you while we were doing the Headwall thing, people are like, you should play Motley Crue. We only had like one or two songs for Motley Crue. And they're like, you should have a more Motley Crue in your set list, your voice and everything else. So when that um, ended... I said, all right, let's come up with Poison and Motley Crue, and I put the two names together, Poison from the album cover, and then took Crue um, and put that together, and I put on an ad, and I had some people join, and we did some garage stuff, and um, <laughs> it kind of went from there and played a lot of small clubs. Only on the Rock and Roll Chicago Podcast.